Okay guys, it's me Imad from Nelson Darwin Park Tech YouTube channel. So today we are going to learn about how to find the data type of a variable within the Python, within the PyCharm compiler. As we know that usually we do not use to define the type of a variable in Python like uh, and it will uh, directly assume it out like if we have a variable that is a is equal to uh, 12 okay now you can see that we do not use to define the type of this variable like the or the data type of this variable okay but we have assigned this variable a number that is the integer number so python will categorize this variable as the integer type variable and one more thing that variables are the empty spaces you can for your simplicity you can say that these are the empty spaces within the memory in which you can store any sort of data like at this time in this a variable we have stored 12 as the integer data okay now uh, we have a special function that is called as type type of a this type function will help us to find that the variable is of which data type either it is integer float string double or whatsoever so we can uh, write like this and we can also use to write print type of a because type of a will give us the answer okay but we we have to print that answer on the uh, console okay that is python console so now we need to run it out and we can see that it is it 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 it, it gives us the integer it gives us the integer uh, class or huh? integer data type now we will go for certain other like uh, if uh, b is equal to like 3.123 okay so this is float type so because decimals are float one so type type of b and what we will get we will see uh, yeah it says us that the type of this variable b is float although we do not use to define in the start okay but python will auto auto assign this b as the uh, as according to its uh, value now in c is equal to string print of type c okay now we need to run it out and here we can see that for c it gives us type of c gives us the string class so in this way we can find any sort of data type of any variable so hopefully you got the concept regarding how to find the data type of a variable within the pie chart. so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe